One man with one dream. Jesus Fabianski rises to the top of Italian football. With aspirations to become the greatest of all time, follow this journey as he rises to the top. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. This is a new FC 24 player career mode, and let's get right into it. All right, we look good. I had to put my face cam down here in the bottom left, but it will be back up to the top left after we get done creating the character. A little bit of a surprise for those that have been on this channel for quite some time. Jesus Fabianski finally makes his debut. Now, Fabianski might sound familiar, and it is. James Fabianski, the striker from the USA, now has a brother, Jesus Fabianski a winger from Italia, and I definitely have to make some changes real quick to his name. Fabianski, number seven, from Italy, born 2004, December 31st. He's gonna be a 17 year old, and I'm ready. I'm gonna make him probably, let's go with five foot, let's go five, nine. I like five, nine, 152. Let me know though, if you guys wanna see some changes, maybe make him a little bit taller. I know James Fabianski was about six foot, so I kinda wanna make him around the same height, given that they have pretty similar genes. He will be a forward, right forward, a right winger, left footed as well. He's gonna have a wonderful left foot. Him and James Fabianski both had that wonder class left boot and I plan on executing that once again in his career mode. All right, but let's see. If I can import his face, we might be able to get lucky. Let's see, I might just actually make a little bit of a, uh, a mock-up. I kind of remember exactly what James looked like. Kind of had a bit of a, a narrower nose, but he still had those African features for sure. Given that both of their fathers now are the same, the Nigerian father, you know that that gene is gonna be strong in that athleticism. It's kind of giving me an Mbappe feel. A winger with a lot of pace and a lot of ability to make things happen on that pitch. We're gonna find out though exactly what his career has in store. I'm excited. Hopefully everybody else is as well. And I know exactly what to expect in his career mode. It's gonna be greatness. Champions League, hopefully in the first season. I'll see exactly where we want to go in Italy. Maybe I should have done a poll, but I think I might start as a small club and work my way up. All right, but here we go. Time to pretty much be done with this. I'm just looking through, kind of want to pick a few things, change them up, just keep moving. I don't want to make them look necessarily carbon copy of James Fabianski, but I definitely want to have some similar features in there to kind of show that they are related. The ears look good. And here it is. It's time to change up the hair. Now you know I got the dreads in and I kind of like the hairstyles in this game. But I think honestly, if we're gonna start off fresh, it's best that we just get them braided straight down with the cornrows. Fabianski, number seven on his back. It's about that time. We know what to expect with the number seven on the back of the kit. Hopefully he'll have enough skills for me to be able to use them because I definitely am looking forward to getting a lot of goals. Jersey fit, we'll go team fit, keep it pretty much uniform with the squad. And the player boots, you know we gotta switch it up and get something flashy. I'm kinda feeling these right here. The Phantom Elite DF on fire. Kinda like a nose, or I might go for the Tiempos. Yep, Nike Tiempo Legend Elites. That's what we're going for, beautiful boot. Now the gloves, I've had a lot of people comment down below, how do you get gloves, how do you get gloves? And it's not in this menu right here. All right, facial accessories though, not needing any of those. Tattoos, we'll leave them bare for now. And let's get ready to do these animations. Gotta pull my mouse out. And I mean, we should just go for something nice and casual, maybe give praise to the most high. I like that one right there. The salute is cool too. Plant his feet, represent the country, the nation. I like that. But I kinda want something just Italian style. Laid back, nothing too flashy. A bit more relaxed, let's see this one. Okay, he pulls up, oh, like a model. I like that one. It seems like Jesus Fabianski wants to become a model in his lifetime as well. Throws the X up like Mbappe. Not feeling that one necessarily. Let's keep moving though. Throw a heart up to the fans, I like that one. We could do Scorpion, maybe dance and spin. Break it down, oh, okay, I like it. That's a little slow for me though. Spanish dance is cool too. But I'm thinking I wanna go for the slide salute. This one right here is just big and bad, abrasive as well. That's the word I'm looking for. Come in there, slide, salute to the crowd. Another goal, celebrate. All right, and here we go, our free kick. I'm gonna do the deep breath. I feel like I have a lot of good opportunities. But matter of fact, I'm actually gonna go hands on hips. It's one of the oldest ones I like. We'll go hands on hips, and I think we're gonna go the Dutch for the free kick. I like that one. And then, or I mean a PK. And then our running style, we will go with Let's do, I guess we can go medalist. This one looks pretty much the fastest. Or we can go turtle. Hmm. I'm contemplating. I'm not sure exactly which one I want to go with. We can always change it, but I think I'm going to go medalist. This one is definitely the fastest, and I'm looking for a lot of pace out there. 
for sure. I think we're ready to go. No more left to do. Go celebration in the books. And let's do a little recap. Jesus Fabianski, the brother of James Fabianski, ready to go out here and make a name for himself. Playing from Italy, representing that nation, and he will be starting in Italy as well. I'm not sure exactly where to go, but I know after this season, I'm probably gonna get a lot of comments on, you should've went here, went there. And honestly, I am going to start in, I'm really not sure if I should start in the first league here, play for Napoli, that's what I'm feeling, or should I go to Serie B? Now, I should've probably asked everybody on the channel, but I mean, let's just go big. Let's go big and just go right to the Serie A. That's what I'm thinking. We're actually gonna go for Napoli. We're gonna go play for Napoli, the home kid blue, away kid yellow. It's not the greatest team, but I'm pretty sure they have um, Osenheim. I'm not sure if that's really how you pronounce it, but I know he is one of the best Nigerian strikers in the world, if not the best Nigerian player in the world. So we're gonna keep it three minutes on the length. Ultimate difficulty, we see it right there, and it is that time. Let's go. All right, it is that time. We are here in Napoli. I'm pretty sure that's the city of Italy we're in. Let me know in the comments down below. If I'm a little fresh on that one. And there he is, Jesus Fabianski, getting ready for the career, and it is that time. I'm gonna skip because we've been down this road plenty of times. A new career means new goals and new aspirations for each and every player. We know what to expect though. Jesus Fabianski has that lineage in his blood and he's ready to go out there and get assists on those crosses and score plenty of goals as well. I'm thinking we're gonna set the, the marks high and I'm not gonna choose a target team until somebody down below says, you should go here. We start recommending things, we start voting on the channel, we'll start making some moves. All right, it is that time though. I'm pretty sure we have a few preseason matches to get into and a few activities as well. A player boost, and I know which one I wanna go with. The Virtuoso Heartbeat one, and I'm gonna work on getting my Virtuoso points up. I want that long distance runner so I can keep using my pace over more distance, and then I also want that explosive ability as well. I'm not too sure right now what it's called, but I'm pretty sure it's called Quick First Step. But let's see right now if we can go put on an ability. Here we go. We are now in the personality area, and this is the one I'm most interested in. Rapid. This ability right here will allow us to keep moving with pace down the pitch. Now the next one I'm looking for right here is Quick Step. I was correct. The Quick Step ability allows us to accelerate faster during explosive sprints. You gotta have 50% for that one. So I guess we'll just put on a technical right now, rock out with it, and I'm pretty sure it's time for the preseason. I think I'll see everybody out there with our first match, hopefully victorious, and hopefully taking home a huge W. All right, it's that time. Jesus Fabianski coming off the bench at the left wing, though. A bit of a surprise, and we are ready for it. Professional debut of Jesus Fabianski. Not a lot on his name, but he has a history in this game, given that his brother, James Fabianski, went on to be one of the greatest players that we've ever seen. And of course, a handball to get started. Not exactly what you want to see for the first touch of his career. I might have to move my screen, I'm thinking, so we can see the score. It'll show, it'll show. I'm good, I'm gonna keep it there. Sayore, a good move now inside the box, looking for a goal. Oh my goodness, but Di Lorenzo, one of our defenders, comes in and gets a great challenge, gets the ball off the boot. I'm gonna make sure to stay on my left side here of the left wing, and hopefully we can do a switch of the pitch. Beautiful touch, looking for a pass now. Fabianski, up to Oliveira. A beautiful pass back. Looking for a pass across the pitch, and there it is. Good touch, Augusta. Looking for a shot now, maybe curling in the back of the net. And I gotta get really good. I gotta get close to that net if I even wanna get a chance of hitting that shot. Beautiful touch, Zelensky. Fabianski down on the ball. Looking for Osenham, but he has his own shot. Looking for the goal, and it's a goal in the back of the net for Jesus Fabianski. His first shot at the net, and it's a goal. No doubt about it, this is what he's about. You see his teammates coming over and celebrating with him. An illustrious career is about to begin, believe me. Steps inside the box with the weak foot and he lets it fly right past the keeper. Those type of shots, I better get used to those. Especially in this European Shield because I'm not sure if we're gonna have a lot of those looks when it comes down to the Serie A season. Jesus Fabianski's on this Napoli side and I think they might be doubted going into this season coming up. I'm not too sure. 
Maybe somebody can give me some history on Napoli. Give me the 401k, give me the schooling down in the comments. And I would greatly appreciate that. Let me know, how do y'all feel about the face cam? Do you guys like it in the gameplay? Do you guys like it only in the pre-match? Just give me a heads up and I'll make sure it happens in the next episode. Oh, a good turn by Benson now. Looking for the attack and it's M2 Aduni. And a great save by Golini. A great save by the goalie, Golini. It's gonna be a tongue twister right there. I'm looking for the ball now inside on the cross. And here it goes. Ball in, ball out. And Rodriguez right into the back of the net. Burnley, there's some beast on the set pieces. And we've seen it right there. Ball came flying in hot. And Rodriguez caught it with his forehead on the attack. Let's see it again. Just jumps around three players on the Napoli side. And the number nine man just goes in there and gets the goal like he's supposed to. Jumps up right past Gabriel. And Golini, too slow to react. Just a well-timed header. A good pass now inside. Zelensky looking for Osimhan. And there it is, a beautiful pass. Oh, foul, thank you. It's definitely a foul. I'm already liking how awesome hand plays. He moves that ball with skill, patience, and he comes back with the pace. Let's see it again. He slows it down and goes to leave the man behind. But obviously the number five on Burnley had something to say about that one. All right, I wanna see what he's about. If he can hit this free kick, I'm just gonna let him take it every time. He steps up and he goes for the shot. And a beautiful hit! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Whoa, 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 whoa! Almost getting a bit cheeky there, kicking the ball. And a beautiful knee slide, turns it up. The Napoli crowd making a large travel to Germany. Dortmund they are right now. He swings it outside of the wall. Comes right back in, hits the crossbar, the post. And a beautiful shot. Oh my goodness! I'm not sure if I'm gonna be taking free kicks on his team, given how he just struck that ball. I'm not sure if I'm hitting that one every time like that. And I have no issues allowing him to shoot that shot either. Good touch. Jesus on the run. He has the pace and he has the will to go out here and score one. I'm looking for the cross though. Osimhen, where you at? Here we go, teammate on the run. Ah, but not good enough. Good touch. Swung in. Oh, touch from Zelensky. Oh, what a finish! What a strike from Zelensky! Ball perfectly played in from Jesus Fabianski. Zelensky taps it off his knee and lets it fly straight to the right side of the net. No surprise, their keeper could be fired after this one. It is preseason. I'm not sure if they're in the Premier League still, but playing like that, they definitely won't be after this season if they are. All right, and that is the match in the books. A great one at that. Senior debut, one assist, one goal for Jesus Fabianski. Plenty more to come, and I'm pretty sure we won't have too many recaps after this match. But if we do, I'll see everybody back at the main menu. Another day, another look for a victory. I'm pretty sure we're here at Signal Aduna once again. BVB running through the stands. It's going to be a great matchup, though. Maybe a Champions League affair. Maybe a Europa League. I'm not too sure where Spurs will be at. But that is who we're playing today. It's going to be Tottenham Hotspurs versus Napoli FC. An Italian versus English match. And I'm ready. Lobota, ah, not the pass I wanted. I wanted someone over the top there. Looking for the left-footed shot. He has it in his arsenal. And Madison back on the ball, number 10. Forcing the three off his back. And Richarlison. Wow. Okay. I wish Richarlison would play like this in real life. Those bets will be hidden on him for sure. Look at him doing the duck walk too. He looks so much different. Look at this. Boom, walling him off, holding him off, a good pass and what a touch. Oh my goodness, left foot right to the right. Look at his touch. Beautiful shot right past the CB and the goalkeeper. I'm not sure who we have in net, but he needs to be fired. He needs to be sacked automatically. Finish, boom. Just like that, let's go. Right back at him with a great finish. Off of the assist from Jesus Fabianski. No surprise, he's right here in the mix. Of course, passing his teammates and letting them shoot the ball for once. A good pass inside and a great finish. Right footed, slots it right away. One time shot outside the box. And a beautiful strike. Oh my goodness, that was a great finish. Goes inside on Saar on the rip. Wide open shot for Charleston. Oh my goodness. 
Now it's 1-2 on the score sheet. And is that his signature celebration? The chicken? Because he's hit that twice on us today. And he's looking for the hat trick, that's for sure. He is looking for this hat trick. Make a play, Osim Hine in the run. And it has to be perfect, right to the boot. Robotica, Osim Hine, back inside. Look for the shot, oh, that's the play right there. It all starts with Jesus Fabianski getting that ball off the boot, sliding it off to Osim Hine. Then he's gonna run it with his pace. Let's see it again, a great pass across the way. Didn't even expect to hit him. And he comes right back with a great finish to Capitan. A left-footed shot, goalkeeper had no idea that one was coming in. Even Steven on the day, two apiece. Traore coming off the pitch now. And it looks like we have Boleanto coming on for him. Looking for the play that's gonna set our future up. And of course, Son on the ball in the defensive play. And Richarlison. With the hat trick on the day. All right, Richardson, you can have that one. You can have that one all day. This ultimate difficulty is gonna to be tough. It's gonna to be very tough to go against good teams and get those wins. But I mean, my player isn't the best right now, so when he becomes the best, I'm sure I'll have a different say in the game. The ref ends up calling something there, making sure we don't get another chance to keep running with that ball. Not exactly what we wanted to see today, a loss on the sheet, and I'm pretty sure that was our last match of this episode. Just want to say thank you very much for tuning in, and I'll see everybody back in a minute. Of course, they're going to showcase this right here. Hat trick Richarlison shines in Napoli FC win. Liverpool also crowned the European Shield champions. They were going crazy over there. They were whooping everybody pretty much. I might try and go to Liverpool. They look really good. So we might try and go there in this career mode. All right, Richarlison with the hat trick, no surprise, came in and dominated us. But let's take a quick look at the squad hub. We're gonna take a quick look at who our players are. Here he is, Osim Hen. Probably our best guy on the team, no doubt about it. Gabriel Labotica. Here he is, uh, 83 overall. I'm pretty sure he had a goal, but it's not gonna show us exactly who had goals and who didn't. But I know Jesus Fabianski had a great game, that first one. He had a goal and an assist in his very first match playing for Napoli. All right, everybody, just want to say thank you very much for tuning in. Stay safe, everybody out there, and peace out, y'all.